Not everybody who heaps dung on you is your enemy. Not everybody who gets you out of shit is your friend. Can I tell you a joke? Are you? Because it's been so serious, I <laughs> This happened in Michigan. A tiny little bird was very exuberant and happy and winter started coming. It should have gone south, but it was so happy it forgot about it and little late. Then it tried to fly, but because of the cold, the its wings froze and it fell down. Then a cow was passing that way. A cow was passing that way and it dropped a heap of dung and it fell right on the bird. So inside this dung, the warmth of the dung caused thaw of the wings, the ice melted away and it felt happy and warm. Tick, 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 it started tweeting from inside the dung. It couldn't get up but it was happy inside the dung. A cat was going by, it heard this bird tweaking, it opened up the dung and ate up the bird. The moral of the story is, not everybody who heaps dung on you is your enemy. Not everybody who gets you out of shit is your friend. <laughs> and above all, <laughs> and and above all, when you're in a heap of shit, keep your mouth shut. <laughs> this is… this is… no, I'm saying this because… this is because we have created a world now, if I have trouble, I must talk to everybody in the world. They're all going to give thousand solutions. No, when you feel you're in trouble, please just spend some time upon yourself. Invest some time and energy upon yourself because there is no trouble which troubles you except what you allow, isn't it? What is it? You must invest some time and energy upon yourself. This value of solitude is totally gone in the world in this generation. Please bring it back if you want to make yourself of some substance. <laughs>